This episode is sponsored by Purposely Prepared Picnics. Get a Purposely Prepared Picnic brought to you by Chef Lena and Picnic Coordinator Allison for your next date night, anniversary, bridal shower, romantic brunch, marriage proposal, and more. With a variety of themes to choose from, Purposely Prepared is a luxury pop-up picnic experience you wouldn't want to miss. They deliver, set up, and decorate wherever you want. Follow Purposely Prepared on Instagram to check out their themes, prices, and much more. What up, Joe? What up, Joe? What up, Joe? We about to talk about... Sex, baby. Oh. oh wait, that ain't it. Uh, how the Rocky song go? Uh, Do that for me, Cena. <laughs> how the fuck are you? We have in this corner, Wayne and that. Who me? Um, let's just say a ball fade in glasses. Wayne and in a ball fade in glasses. Thirty eight C's. These are not C's. Thirty eight. They they might be C's, C's actually actually big ass we got Peggy Hill woo I, it was it's Peg Bundy oh even worse Peg Bundy hey this is a special episode of cocktails with cocktails because all we about to talk about is this nasty motherfucker <laughs> she hit me up and she was like guess what nigga and I said what bro she's like I'm about to peg a nigga and I said. Okay. She's like, I want you to go to the store with me and pick out my peg toy. He's lying. Uh, he, okay, I said, can I go to the store <laughs> he, with you? I and told you him that I up. needed to get a new one. So, we, me and Peg Bundy, we go to the store and she picks out, what was it? You brought it with you? Uh, I yeah. didn't because I let him keep it. Uh, of course, it's his ass. Um, <laughs> it was a 7.5 inch. It was a six and a half inch oh. purple yeah. um, dildo. She fucked this nigga in color, okay? I, I did. Purple. And living color in his booty hole. So I'ma shut the what fuck up. Do. I do in yeah. living color. Yeah. So what and we gonna I did do everything in living color. Shut the fuck up and we gonna let Peg Bundy tell us <laughs> how this started. From the from the initial conversation of her fucking him to the moment that she went and got the strap. Skip that part because you know we already talked about it. Okay. And then tell us that night. We ready. Okay. Put the mics away. Put the mics away. Okay, well, you know. She so, made him suck the strap, y'all. Oh, my God. Can I tell my tale? Sorry. Let I'm, me I'm just sorry. tell that my just story. Wild as fuck to me. This is my story. Y'all see how he do me, dog? Okay. She called him a little um, bitch. I don't think I did. I don't remember. I don't remember. We said a lot of things. We said a lot of things. But, um, so, yeah, you know, coming to you live is Peg Bundy. But, uh, so, it initially started, he... Asked me um, if I would be interested in pegging him because he knew that that was just something that I've always I talk about it. Um, talk about it on social media. Um, I talk about it on the show. He's listened to the show. He was like, hmm, I wonder if, you know, you'd, you'd be interested in pegging me. I've never been pegged before. So this will both be our first time. Let's get it. I'm like, all right, cool. Sure. I was very nervous because I've never I don't have no rhythm. And I also don't really ride like that. So I'm like, I wonder how my stroke going to be because <laughs> I don't I don't know how this is going to go. And I'm also nervous. But, you know, um, we're, we're kind of friends. So, you know, it, it worked out because I was comfortable with them. Um, so, uh, well, when I got there, he already had his toys out. He had some toys out. He was already practiced, too, he because so he not new to this. He's, he true he's, to this? He's, he's prepped. He had prepped this. But he, you know, he had told me he was like, you know, um, I didn't eat a lot today. Um, I prepped my butt. So, you know, he in the mud. He did all that. He took care of it. So, you know, there wouldn't be any accidents. Um, and um, initially, the first strap I used was actually one of his. What size was it? How did y'all set the mood? Uh, yeah, what music did y'all listen to? So Silent? we didn't listen to any music, actually. We just, you know, listened to noises, our noises, <laughs> in each other. Hey, <laughs> was this in a house or an apartment? It was in an apartment. So the nigga wow. next door is like, what the fuck is going on over there? <laughs> probably. Okay. Right. Probably. Um, Who but, moaned harder, you or him? Um, I feel like I don't make a lot of noise during sex. I don't know if that's true, though, because I do actually go deaf when I come. What? My hearing mutes a little bit. And Look at them little ears. I believe I, Are you making a lot of noise? I, that's what I'm, I don't know, because I, I don't really think I make what a lot of noise. What noise when you was thrusting in that nigga's booty I usually booty hole. just, my, I didn't make any noise. I was just like, yeah, take this dick. I was talking. You told him that? Yeah. Tell us, okay. Tell us what you told him. <laughs> I like, that's the, mo 
that's the only say, thing that I, I was yeah. not creative enough. I should have came up with more Wait, catch wait, wait. Cena said he made a girly voice and did, said yes. Did he he didn't make a girly voice. He didn't say he was like, he was like, all right, I got you. He was just going like, oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh no! Like that's that's really it. Like yeah, hit it. he told me to hit it, which I did. Like I was hit hitting, what? It. hitting it. What you mean? I was also went okay. So let me start. You didn't even let me finish how uh, I started. It happened so quick. <laughs> it happened so quick. So um, when I got there, like I originally chose one of his. You know, I made him suck my strap. <laughs> what did you say to make did him you do this? You grab his head. Yes, I did. I did grab well, his did head. Did you say anything to him? Um, I was like, well, this is the, th- the first thing I definitely want you to do is suck my dick. And he did. He got on his knees and he sucked my strap and he looked me in my eyes as he was sucking my strap. And I totally understand now why some studs want you to suck the strap, even though uh, I apologize to the stud that I dated way back when and I would not suck your strap because uh, I thought it was a joke. And, <laughs> and um, I didn't understand why you would want somebody to suck your strap because, you know, you can't feel it. But now I get it. It's a visual thing. So my bad. If I ever come across another stud, I would definitely I suck, suck her strap. strap. I feel like I'm missing out now. So I would definitely. You want her to pay you too? I would That's definitely like suck her strap if I come across another stud. Would most you definitely. Suck her strap? I suck her strap. <laughs> okay. See now you right. get to pick oh. a, a clip. I've never see. I've never. I've never um strapped a woman. I've never. Stra- I have been strapped, but I've never strapped a woman. But so I've been tomorrow, once. I've it kind of interested in it. strapping a woman. But come on, let's be real. Best look like dildo. she a strapping queen. So I you look definitely. Like you got show I us definitely your, show got us your stroke. I don't. I don't want to because I'm embarrassed. No, show us your stroke. I'm dead ass. No, if this, you just showed your ass last last episode, but you can't show us your stroke real quick. So my stroke is terrible because I feel like I have a terrible like fuck face when I'm fucking. No, let's see. No, I don't. I'm embarrassed. I will pay twenty dollars. How much you got on this? Fifty on it. She got fifty on it. You got it. Can you bend over for me and I can practice on you and I'll show the stroke. I will pay Trav ten dollars more because I feel like I need a person to. All right, Trav. But I also hold the camera. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no, Cena. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Got to get down. Do no, it exactly no, how said, we did it. Like he got to be no, a mystery. Everything. She'll, she'll do it. Oh, you'll do it. Yeah. yeah cool. Let's okay. go. Okay. <laughs> Because I, I didn't want to so take. We got to be book. a missionary because that's the only way I fucked him. Because he's a little taller than me and I'm kind of short, so mm. I couldn't like really. We tried to we tried to have sex, you know. I tried to hit it from the back because I really wanted to hit it from the back and I couldn't. Yeah, that's an idea. Y'all got to be like so, similar size. Yeah. So right. So yeah, it was kind of. It's kind of hard. Say I get a missionary. Yes, get a missionary. Oh, you fucked a missionary? Yeah, I fucked a missionary. That's how I did it. Yes, I fucked a missionary. Nigga, it wasn't your booty hole. It was my booty hole. The one time I had anal sex was missionary. Because I always learned that the train, that's how trains be doing it. Who? Trains. Tran- who? Oh yeah, that is how. Um, that they are called transgender. I know, but it's still you're on like air talking so, about. Wait, wait, talking to the mic. Okay, so you know, I was get, I was, I was in a missionary. Okay. All right, I'm gonna talk this out for y'all. Yeah, let's so, talk it out. So, Trav, can you put the camera towards uh, Bess's uh, uh, like mouth? All right, so in my booty hole, in my in, in the booty hole, you have a cute little mm, going on down there. <laughs> All right, so let's get this straight. Okay. You was okay. This is kind of sexy. Yes. Is this you? Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, this is how I was fucking him. You know, I was you know bending his legs back, and he was stroking it. We was looking oh. in each other's eyes, and he was stroking it. Yep, just like that. I pray yep. y'all can hear her. Yep, the, the mic is right here, so I'm pretty sure they can hear me, and I'm kind of loud. Sure so, yeah, he was stroking it as okay. I was fucking a missionary. Oh, okay. Why do I feel like you having fun right now? I am having a good time. She's beautiful. Smack her ass. I know you smacked his. Oh, yeah, definitely. You smacked his ass? Yeah, a couple oh. times. All right, talk to us. Talk. Yeah, tell us what you like said this. to him. <laughs> so no. he was like, yeah, take this dick. Did he point his toe? He didn't point his toe because they were like this. Like, his legs were like this, and I was down. And you said, take this dick just like that. Your voice dick. wasn't deeper. No, so, my, my voice is naturally deep. I, I have a question. So, man. yeah, what's your question? Like, so when, when you were doing this, yeah. like, what? Was, were you turned on or was it just oh, like... Oh, she climaxed. Oh, I was turned on. I had I come. Was tripping. She was I came. Uh-huh. Um, and this was not double-sided before. from... No, this was I, not a double-sided okay. dildo or anything like that. No. Okay. Um, I was aroused and I came before like we... Because we also had sex. Like he also had sex with me. Wait, did y'all fuck before you strapped? No. He ate my pussy before we strapped. Okay, so mm. how was the dick? It was good. Now, did you fuck him like a little bitch? Did he fuck you like a little Who bitch? Who fucked better, him or you? Woo-hoo! I actually feel like I he you. fucked better because he has more experience fucking women than I have fucking men. Oh, man, did I'm he tell you the strong. same shit? Did he say, take this dick, bitch? Yeah, he did, you know. So, was, this wasn't his first rodeo. No, he um, had a point. 
Do he it know that your name is Peg? Bundy? Her legs is getting tired. She's <laughs> like, her leg came. Her, baby. I'm so sorry. Smack her ass one more time and let it go. Yeah, okay. One more time. Is that is that? Thank you, thank you, honey. No comment. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Thank you, Cena, for being. Uh, how did that feel? Did you want Bessa to strap you after that? I'm a little excited. <laughs> It was a great time. I enjoyed it very much. But um, what was what was we talking about? What was the other question? Start to end experience. Did he come? Did yes, he, come? he did come. Where did he come? Um. So first he came on his chest. The first time we were doing it, like the first time when I was fucking him, you know, he was came. He yeah, you fucked him more than Was once? he laying on his back? <laughs> yes, he, he was laying on his back. Okay. You fucked him from the back too. I couldn't really fuck him from the back because our height difference wasn't making it work. And then, like, I couldn't also, like, I was trying to fuck him from, like, you know, get him to lay all the way so down, but Shaq. I just couldn't. Huh? None. <laughs> uh, well, no. Hmm. No, I did not fuck Shaq. Um, so, I wouldn't be surprised if Shaq liked to get, I'm not going to say that. So, no. you, would you double side deal over him? Uh, you know what I might? Would you do it again? I would. I, I want you to, so I triple dog dare you right now to text him and say, change my name in your phone to Peg Bundy. <laughs> okay I'm hot That was a workout You think he'll come on the show? I don't know I don't know I doubt it Tell him he can do a mask my booty. Uh, He can come on via Zoom So we don't even know who he is I love to hear how he Like I want to know Like did he fuck your mouth? Yes Yes did I he, fucked his mouth And he fucked my mouth Did, did he nut in your mouth? No Did you fake Oh like, wait Yes, once. Did you fake moan? Once, like, how many like, rounds like did y'all go? Don't it sound like they went for three days? We, <laughs> we, we, we went for, we went at it for a few hours. Was it one of some of the best sex you ever had? It was one of the best sexual experiences I have ever had. Yes. Hey, I want you to text him right now. One, change my name in your phone to Peg Bundy. Okay. Two, when you gonna fuck my mouth again? Uh, so we've actually already discussed that. So I'm not gonna ask him that. Is this a white man? No. Am Ooh, head, it's a nigga? It's in a black man. It has to be a white man. Yeah, I just realized. It's a black man because that was no, one of the reasons why we I went didn't. To the sex store, I didn't buy was, a white. I almost bought a, buy a white, white dick. dick. And I said, why would you fuck a black man with a white dick? That is so fucking racist. Is he real muscular? No, he's no, not really. I will. Mm. I'm just trying to get my mental she picture said his together. Dick had muscles. Not really. He's not necessarily super muscular, but he's not like frail and super skinny either. So. Yeah. Was he so, Trav, did that turn you on? Did you want Lester to take care of you? He was flexible, yeah. Which I appreciate because I'm pretty flexible. Trav said like, he's not I like at that to point be in his life. And dipped and moved around. I'm so sorry. Really? He's not at that did point. Did he pick you up? Almost at one point. Like he from tried back, to, but, he was hitting oh. me from the back, and I, I ain't never want to pick nobody up. It was back. very interesting. Wheelbarrow. Yeah, that's essentially. Yeah, that's different. That shit hard. Really? You a fucking pussy. I didn't got Look, so lazy. This has been a freaky ass episode. <laughs> I really appreciate y'all. I want y'all to do me a huge favor. I want you, Cena, to text a random dude in your phone right now. I'm horny. Trav, I want you to text somebody that you used to deal with randomly right now on your phone and say, You should have ate my ass when we talked. That's all I need from y'all. I want y'all to have a great day. This has been a great episode of Cocktails with Cocktails. Okay. I will admit it's a little hot. I feel a little mic in here. It's very hot. And, uh, yeah. yeah, you wore a hoodie. Well, I mean, I wasn't even hot until I... Like... Yeah, that's fine. This story was enough to at last us eight episodes. <laughs> Nigga, we gonna call it Peg Bundy. Like, everybody's gonna click play. Oh my god. Brandon. Wait, was it shit on the dick? No, there was. So, um, I'm not even really sure if he came out of his ass because I've come out of my ass before. Um, but there was like, it was he like... He gave you the, truffle butter? No. Um, that's what I'm about to say. I didn't see anything. Like, I didn't see any truffle butter. Like, I didn't see anything on it or anything like that except the lube that we had already put on. What kind of lube y'all used? Um, we raw used... Raw and explicit? Yes, we used raw and explicit lube, actually. Yes. There we go. I appreciate that. Shout out to Miana giving niggas booty hoes life. This has been a great episode of Cocktails with Cocktails, and I am disturbed. <laughs> Whew. Man. So this promo ad is by Keep In Touch Self Care Spa. They offer 60 to 90 minute massage services, aromatherapy, hot stones, and stretch therapy. Also, yoni stones and jail foot scrubs. Their Instagram is Keep In Touch underscore Self Care Spa. Mention cocktails with cocktails and get $10 off a 90-minute service. I will be honest. I've had this service plenty of times, and it's the best massage I've ever got. I definitely like the uh, 
massage with the stretch because it gets my legs ready so I can get my ass ate and have my legs up in and out. Hmm. I'm going to have to look into them. Do they do Yoni stone massages? I'm really confused by that. Well, you got to hit them up and ask. I am. Yeah. I am. Look at you, Yoni. You ready? Look, this I am because I episode. love my Yoni. I want y'all to have so. safe sex. Cena, you keep cheating, and we're going to move forward. I am single. Woo, so she's not cheating. Okay, well, cheat when you get in a relationship again. 